nobody stopping me, not even stupid. I better love. Sir, please move your tank. Fine, I will keep honking. No, you won't. Take this. My car, oh my gosh. I've had it with this honking. Goodbye. My name is Jeff. I am bus. Oh shit, a lobby bully. Stupid bully. More lobby bullies, oh hexes. Oh shit, really. Roll, roll, roll. I did. ton four-motored Kawanishi seaplane, the kind we call Emily's. Miss Emily's a tough old girl. Right now she's screaming for help and telling Tokyo by radio where we are. So long, Emily. To win a gunfight, you gotta be able to move effectively and put shots on target. At this marijuana grow house in Miami-Dade County, this particular man right here is our perp. We're gonna, this right here is Detective John Saavedra and he is going to be very integral where they're coming up here and trying to get these people to let them in to this house. Well, they don't and we see a bunch of federal officers show up, but this guy has distracted them long enough for our bad guy to come out, guns a-blazing. And now you got two federal agents, actually about four of them having a gunfight with him. And you see there that he has injured Officer Savage, actually shot him three times in the guts. He's still in the fight, even though he's badly shot. And then one of the officers finally here is able to get off a cranial hit. You see it right there, that you saw that cranial hit that puts him down for the count. Now now to breaking news that we're tracking out of Southwest Houston. That is where a hit and run crash ended with a shooting. Yeah, and it was caught on camera. This all happened around 945 last night on the Beltway at Main Street. KPRC 2's Kathy Hernandez is live now with who police are looking for this morning. Very scary. I mean, this happened right out on the road, Kathy. There you go. That's right. Multiple gunshots right here on the road. Very scary for drivers around here. We have cell phone video. We want you to take a listen.
Wow, that is cell phone video of the shooting on the feeder of Beltway 8 in South Maine. Police say it's where three vehicles were involved in an accident at about 9.30 last night. A couple blocks right here on the feeder uh, and uh, at the light when the suspect stopped, when the victim stopped, the two suspects got out of the vehicle and started shooting at, uh, at our victim.